Welcome, Mr. Handicap. Let's take a look at race number six on Friday at Santa Anita. It is the grade one Breeders' Cup Juvenile Phillies. It's a mile and 16th with a purse of $200,000. Cardinal Horse Racing Nation, the last 23 years, 16 winners this race won their final prep race. And in the last 23 years, the favorite has won 11 times, but only twice in the last 10. Let's take a look at the field. The one horse at 4-1 to is Candide, and you can't knock this horse at all. I mean, she broke her maiden in Saratoga, then he stretched out in Grey One Alcibiades. She had no problem at all getting the distance. You're getting 4-1, to one, Todd Pletcher trained, one horse, Candide. I will use her on my tickets. Take a look at the two horse, Jody Spride at 15 and one, ridden by Flavian Pratt. She's a perfect two for two. She is stretching out for the first time, and she's looked impressive in both of her wins. She's side by American Pharaoh, so stretching out should be no problem at all for her. She is taking on Greater Stakes Company for the first time. She's getting 15 1 on a two horse, Jody Spride, ridden by Flavian Pratt. 20 to 1 is the three horse, scalable. She's a maiden. She finished well last time, finishing second. Trained by Todd Pletcher. Getting 20 to 1 on three horse, scalable. 30 to 1 is to 4, where's my ring? She's also a maiden. She's 0 for 3. She's got some sport, poor speed figures. I'm getting 30 to 1 on the four horse. Where's my ring? At 30 to 1, it's the 5. Omaha Girl. She's got a nice record out of three races. She's got two wins. But uh, those speed figures, they're not going to cut it. Getting 30 to 1 on the 5 horse, Omaha Girl. Take a look at the 6, Chatelas. At 8 to 1. She broke a maiden at Delmar and picked up a grade two win last time out at this track at Santa Anita at the distance of a mile and 16th going gate to wire. Getting eight to one on a six horse shot to loss. Then there's your morning line face. She's trying to do what her mom did 11 years ago. Four to five, it's Tamara. Go back and watch our last race. She looks so impressive in that race. Went about six and three quarters. The trainer Richard Mandela, well, he trained her mom. And he's won this race three times. He has a total of nine Breeders' Cup wins. All of Mandela's Breeders' Cup wins have come at Santa Anita. She's the best horse in the race. Question is, can she get the distance? Getting four to five on a seven horse Tamara. I will use Tamara on my tickets. Take a look at the eight horse at 20 to one. It's Esprit on Chant. She broke a maiden last time out. She's stretching out for the first time. She's going to have to step up those speed figures. She does get Juan Hernandez. He knows how to win at Santa Anita. Getting 20 to 1 on 8 horse. A spree on Chant. I think this horse is the most interesting horse in this field. The 9 horse at 12 to 1. Bright work. She won her first four races, including the grade 3 win at Saratoga and the grade 1 spinaway. Also at Saratoga. Last time out, she got to the stretch and she just fell apart. Was it the distance? Or maybe she just had a bad day at the track. I think I think she's one of the most interesting horses in this field, especially at twelve to one. Getting twelve to one on a nine horse. Bright work. 
At 30 to 1, that's the 10, accommodate Eva. Broke her maiden last time out at Keeneland. Was it about two and a half? She's trained by Dallas Stewart. Getting John Velasquez at 30 to 1. Take a look at Life Talk at 20 to 1. Two races back, she broke her maiden at Saratoga. And then over a sloppy track. And the grid one for Zet. She finished third. The Frazette has produced six of the last 12 Breeders' Cup Juvenile Philly winners. You're getting 20 to 1 on Iran Ortiz and Todd Pletcher. I will use the 11 horse Life Talk on my tickets. Take a look at the 12. Just FYI. She's side by Justify. She's a perfect two for two. Hooting the win in the great one for Zet. Last time out. She's trained by Bill Mott. Junior Alvarado's aboard. You're getting eight to one on the 12 horse. Just FYI, I will use the 12 horse on my tickets. And to close out the field, it's Allie's Beach. She broke a maiden in Saratoga. And finished fourth, great one spin away. Then third last time out in Alcibiades, she's trained by Tom Amos and Tyler Gaffleone is aboard. Getting 31 on 13 horse Alley's Beach. These are the horses I'm going to use on my tickets. I'm going to use just FYI. Life Talk, Candied. Of course I'm using Tamara. I'm keeping an eye out on Bright Work. It's a very, very interesting horse in this race. Also, I'm going to pick the win. Yeah, I'm going to go with the favorite. I'm going with Tamara. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Let me know who you're picking in this race. Good luck.